Hello, my name's Ollie Townsend. I'm one of the orthopaedic doctors. I've come to examine your knee today, if that would be all right. Mm -hmm. That's Can fine. you confirm your name for me, please? Jane Smith. And how would you like me to address you today? Jane is fine. Brilliant. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, can I start by asking if you're in any pain at all today? No, none. Brilliant. Well, if we do cause you any pain at all, let me know. We can stop the examination at any time. Okay. What I'm going to need you to do is I'm going to need you to stand and walk backwards and forwards across the room while I assess your legs and how you walk. I can then get you up onto the couch and we'll do some movements uh, with your legs to see how your knee's working. Is okay. that all right? That's great. Brilliant. Yeah. If I can ask you to stand up for me, please. Okay. I'm going to have a look at your legs from the front. Can I ask you to face away to the wall for me? And can you face away from me, please? And turn one more time for me, please. Brilliant. Can I now ask you to walk across towards uh, this side of the room for me, please? And then turn around, walk back across the room for me. And then turn around and walk back towards me. And that's great. Stop there. Thank you. So can I ask you to take to the couch, please? Mm -hmm. Brilliant. Lovely. And if you can just rest your legs down for me, please. I'm going to start by having a look. I'm going to have a feel of your knees, feeling for any temperature differences, it's equal on both sides, brilliant, and I'm going to feel for any obvious effusion with a patella tap, sweep it, can I ask you to lift your legs straight up off the bed for me please, as far up as you can, brilliant. So and can you bend your knee up as far as you can for me, please? Excellent. So really straighten your leg out again. Just relax your leg. Just going to see if there's any hyperextension of the knee. Brilliant. All right. And I'm just going to bring your knee up to 90 degrees. I'm going to have a feel around your knee now. Let me know if there's any tenderness at all. I get you to put your two knees side by side, please. And I'm going to look from the side. And I'm just going to sit just on your toes there. And I'm going to just test the stress test. The That's everything done. Everything seems to be completely normal today. Okay. Right. Great. Thank, Thank you. you. Hello. My name's Ollie Townsend. I'm one of the orthopaedic doctors. I've come to examine your knee today, if that would be all right. Mm -hmm. That's Can fine. you confirm your name for me, please? Jane Smith. And how would you like me to address you today? Jane is fine. Brilliant. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, can I start by asking if you're in any pain at all today? No, none. Brilliant. Well, if we do cause you any pain at all, let me know. We can stop the examination at any time. Okay. What I'm going to need you to do is I'm going to need you to stand and walk backwards and forwards across the room while I assess your legs and how you walk. I can then get you up onto the couch and we'll do some movements uh, with your legs to see how your knee's working. Is okay. that all right? That's great. Brilliant. Yeah. If I can ask you to stand up for me, please. Okay. I'm going to have a look at your legs from the front, looking at the general muscle bulk and the alignment of the legs from the front. Can I ask you to face away to the wall for me? Excellent. Looking from the sides for any flexion deformity. And can you face away from me, please? I'm looking at the back of the knees for any swellings, scars, or discoloration. And turn one more time for me, please. Excellent. Again, looking for any surgical scars, redness, or swelling around the knees. Brilliant. Can I now ask you to walk across towards uh, this side of the room for me, please? And then turn around, walk back across the room for me. And then turn around and walk back towards me and that's great stop there thank you so looking at normal gait pattern um, no obvious abnormalities there 
can ask you to take to the couch, please. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. Lovely. And if you can just rest your legs down for me, please. I'm going to start by having a look. Again, looking more closely at the quadriceps muscle bulk, looking at the alignment of the knees lying down, looking for any arthroscopy scars. I can see a small scar on the right knee here. There's no obvious redness or swelling. I'm going to have a feel of your knees. Feeling for any temperature differences. It's equal on both sides. Brilliant. And I'm going to feel for any obvious effusion with a patella tap. I can milk down any fluid out of the super patella pouch. Sweep it. And there's no fluid shift on the sweep test. Can I ask you to lift your legs straight up off the bed for me, please? As far up as you can. Brilliant. So the stensor mechanism is intact. And can you bend your knee up as far as you can for me, please? Excellent. So there's a really good range of movement. And straighten your leg out again. Just relax your leg. Just going to see if there's any hyperextension of the knee, which there isn't. Brilliant. All right. And I'm just going to bring your knee up to 90 degrees. I'm going to have a feel around your knee now. Let me know if there's any tenderness at all. No. Around the medial joint line. fibular head laterally, around the patella, quadriceps tendon, around the back of the knee. Fine, all right. Can I get you to put your two knees side by side, please? And I'm gonna look from the side. There's no posterior sag. And I'm just going to sit just on your toes there. There's no laxity on anterior draw testing. I'm going to just Test with the stress test, the medial collateral ligament, the lateral collateral ligament. Those feel normal. That's okay. That's everything done. Everything seems to be completely normal today. Okay. Right. Great. Thank, Thank you. you. To complete my examination, I'd perform a detailed neurovascular assessment of the limb distally. I'd also like to examine the joint above, which is the hip joint, and the joint below, which is the ankle. I perform x-rays in at least two views, AP and lateral, and consider a skyline view if indicated. I'd also like some basic uh, blood tests, including inflammatory markers uh, and a full blood count. If I needed any further imaging for specialist tests, for example, considering a meniscal injury, I would consider an MRI scan.